Hi, hey, welcome to another Cups Tutoring Tutorial. Our goal is to condense information into videos that are somewhat rich in content but still take a very short time to watch. More than one viewing is usually required for a new skill. In this lesson, we're going to try to pull external data over here in the data ribbon from uh, other sources. Um, you'll see some there are there. There are some uh, the same ones if you go to the data menu and get external data. Anyway, we're going to do a couple of them today. We're going to do text and a web page. <clears throat> so if we go to text, we can find our document um, wherever you put it. Um, mine's here in the desktop called Data We Need. And uh, you'll notice that it's just full of commas. So just like when we do paste special or, you know, when we pull columns apart, we're going to say delimit not by tabs but by commas. Now you just make sure your columns look right and, you know, very similar to what we did uh, the other two ways, right? And we delimited text. We'll go ahead and just say general for this one. It says where do we want to put it? Yeah, A1. We got a blank one, so we may as well start in A1. All right. That's kind of all there is to it. Stick in your graphs, your formulas, your... To put a website uh, table into our um, spreadsheet with this version of Excel, we're going to have to go to a file. When you click on HTML, it's going to ask you for an HTML file, which means we have an extra step. We have to go find a browser, go to the website we want to go. If you want to use free lessons um, at our website, slash data.html, that's that shopping list. So, yeah, if you want to grab the shopping list, uh, in this case, we can copy and paste special, or you can file save so we can get that external data we need. I'll just stick it on my desktop. All right. Um, so now we you know, just got to go find data we need, and uh, it's uh, not recognizing it. I'll just say recognize it. Okay. Oh, I didn't put HTML in the end. My fault. Whatever. Open. It says, well, all right, not important. All right. So CSS isn't there. That's okay. We don't need it. We just want the data. So, yeah. Maybe someday this version will insert directly from the website. But uh, yeah, if you have any questions or comments, uh, please let us know, as always. And try some other data types on your own if you've got access to a MySQL database or anything else. Um, thanks for watching. This has been brought to you by Cups Tutoring. Remember to practice these skills without the video right away to help them take hold in the more active part of your memory. And above all, while trying to learn new material, remember to set aside time to get plenty of exercise and sleep. Thank you for watching our demonstration.